Breaking news next at 11. One person rushed to the hospital, plus a timeline for storms tomorrow. Across America with Mega Jackpots, it's Mega Millions. Hey there, America. I'm John Crow. It is Tuesday, January 24th, and tonight's Mega Millions jackpot is an estimated annuitized $31 million. To win that jackpot, you must match these five wine balls plus that gold mega ball. <laughs> now, let's win you some money. Here we go. Your first winning number is 62. That's followed by 33. Up next, we have 50. Your next number is 41. And your final white ball number for this Tuesday evening is 47. Now for the mega ball number, that is 20. Again, tonight's winning numbers are 62, 33, 50, 41, 47, and the gold mega ball is 20. Now, if no match is all six numbers, Friday's jackpot could be more than $50 million. Good luck in Play On America. I've got the newest timing for our severe weather threat tomorrow, the hours for heavy rain and damaging winds, plus the highest risk area for an isolated tornado. I'm in the WREL Live Center with brand new video from the severe tornado damage in southeast Texas. Then new details on the identities of the victims in today's quadruple shooting in Robinson County and the latest on the investigation. Heavy rain, even possibly some severe thunderstorms will move through tomorrow. It's all from this powerful, powerful system moving our way. Thank you for joining us. I'm Deborah Morgan. And I'm Chris Lovingood in for Gerald Owens. You can see right here the future cast showing you by lunchtime tomorrow what well, we can expect to see a lot of rain. WREL has a team of meteorologists tracking this in the WREL Severe Weather Center. But let's start with meteorologist Mike Mays. Mike, people might not even see this right when they're leaving for work or even school. Yeah, the best chance for rain would be tomorrow afternoon, Chris, as you see our timeline for rain. Small chance in the morning, have your rain gear with you when you leave the house. Definitely a solid chance during the afternoon and the potential for some strong to maybe severe storms roughly from about 2 o'clock through about 6 or 7 o'clock. Now we do have a level 1 and 2 risk for severe weather, but after looking at some of the latest model guidance this evening, 